This top 10 has scary videos that you can't afford to ignore. So if you can't finish the whole video, don't say I didn't warn you. This terrifying video is every parent's greatest fear. No, wait, wait, wait. Stop! At 17 seconds, you can see the student is almost over the yellow line when her life is almost permanently changed. I'm so glad everyone's alright, and I just hope the parent and her daughter are able to somehow get past this undeniably terrible memory. A YouTube channel called Sanders Fam has a bizarre sighting on their Tesla motion tracking equipment that they think is a paranormal ghost encounter. The dash icon displays a mysterious figure where none is to be found. Detecting invisible people is something their car has never done before, and is quite an odd coincidence considering they're passing through a cemetery at the time. It accurately detects two people a good distance away at 3 minutes and 39 seconds. It keeps happening on the same corner of the same block, the icon of someone riding a bike dashing away from them. There it is. They are getting creeped out and wonder what it is. That's when they realize around the corner is the final resting place of a YouTuber named Corey Lavery. They talk about him for a while and then as they drive away, there's nobody what? there. Now he's walking that way. Something walks by his grave. Now that is certainly a strange series of events. Caden Parker meets up with some friends at a local skate park and finds someone much older trying to pick arguments with everyone he sees. Big man! Who's big man? You, right? I'm going for a sleeper. Dude, come on. Just, can you just like leave us alone? We're, we're just trying to have a good time. Enjoying the nice weather, like, is it? You know, I'm going for a sleeper. Soon, he turns his attention towards Caden and tells him he's going to put him in a submission hold if he comes down from the ramp. By now, the skate park has mostly cleared out, so it's just a face-off between Caden and this angry stranger. Dude, the police are on the way. I hope you know that. I hope so. I, I didn't, I didn't saw the individual at the skate park. Skate park. And he's kind of picked fights with little kids. <laughs> Alright then. Might as well make it worth it. Yo, tell him to send an officer ASAP. An officer shows up right before things get any more out of hand. I really don't think this is a fake video because the officer walks up and puts him in cuffs straight away. Apparently, he has a long history of doing this and nobody seems to be acting. After he's taken away, the park fills back up with people who are scared away. Caden Parker shows a lot of bravery standing up for them, as well as self-restraint by not stepping forward when challenged. Had this escalated, he could be in as much trouble as the person who is actually in the wrong. He did everything right in my opinion, and is allowed to enjoy the rest of his day peacefully as a result. A YouTube channel called Meet the Vloggers goes exploring a haunted cemetery in the United Kingdom in search of an authentic ghost encounter, and they think they've caught a bizarre moment on tape. After a tight squeeze, the three of them are in and immediately feel surrounded by negative energy. First, we've just come into the um, haunted cemetery and we're going to have a look around. It feels really eerie, like really starting to get How dark to a lot as well. We're staying here. We're doing exploring, She's man. So this girl doesn't understand what exploring means. One already wants to head back while there is still light to be had, but is quickly persuaded to stay. Night falls and their unwavering dread reaches peak levels. 100%. I'm really not. Oh my god, I'm so scared. <laughs> One of them. Layla sees something ahead, but nothing is caught on camera. Aside from an empty walkway, no ghost sighting, at least not yet. Little do they know a fourth person is moments away from joining their trio. They take a few steps forward and Layla begins to freak out again. She must have a sixth sense or something because this time there is frightening paranormal evidence. This is so creepy. No, I'm actually bugging. Go behind us.
A strange and mysterious figure silently approaches them without saying a word. Keep in mind this is after hours and they themselves had to sneak in through the gate so whoever this is, they are not likely a visitor. That leaves a maintenance or security, but if that were the case, then they would have said something to three people trespassing. Night has fallen and they are on their way out when they hear some really scary noises that prompt them to move a little faster. I turn off the torch. What is that? I don't know. Go see what they're doing. Across from them is a humming crying noise coming from some kind of candlelit vigil that they don't want to investigate. If they did, they might have encountered the scariest ghost sighting ever caught on camera. When I say that I have some really scary leaked photos to show you, I'm sure it isn't at all what you had in mind. Visitors at a mausoleum in Alabama were beyond creeped out when they noticed one grave is stained by a greasy substance pooling on the ground. This story got me curious, so I looked up how common this is, and apparently there's a name for it, casket failure. And it's definitely one of the creepiest things I've ever read. Sometimes customers will upgrade to a premium sealed casket that keeps out air and moisture so that you are, should we say, preserved in good condition for longer than normal. But what can sometimes happen over time is gases from decomposing get trapped and build up until they eventually burst the casket open along with the person inside. This effect can also happen if the mausoleum grave itself is sealed airtight around the square opening. Back to this Alabama mausoleum in particular, they analyzed the fluids and found traces of fatty acids that could be from a human or from an animal. My opinion is that looks like it's way too much fluid to be from an animal and I think it's almost definitely casket failure. But I'm not an expert so who